Very good day to all of you. My name is Devina Ghosh. I'm a teacher and today I'm here to teach you adjectives and its kinds. Before I start with adjectives and its kinds, let us have a quick recap of what are adjectives. Adjectives are those words which are used to add something to the meaning of a noun or a pronoun. Now let us see the kinds of adjectives. There are eight kinds of adjectives. The first kind, adjectives of quality. Let us see the examples. Good, beautiful, honest, nice. A good boy describing the quality of the boy. A beautiful girl describing the quality of the girl. An honest man describing the quality of the man. A nice book describing the quality of the book. Let us see the second type. Adjectives of quantity. Let us see the examples. A little, some, whole, enough. I had a little rice. Speaking about the quantity or how much rice I had. I had some food. It also speaks about the quantity of food that I had. I ate the whole cake. Here also it is mentioning how much of the cake I had. I had enough rice. Once again, it is mentioning the quantity or how much of rice did I have. So it was easy, isn't it? The two types of adjectives. Let us see the third type. Adjectives of number. Here, this kind of adjective tells us the number of persons, places or maybe animals or things. For example, many, several, ten, most, all. Many pens, several books, ten men, most men, all books. So here also, these words are speaking about the number of persons or maybe places, animals or things. Let us see the next type. Demonstrative adjectives. Such adjectives point towards certain things. For example, these those, such, that, this. Let us see how these are used. These tables, those books, such persons, that table, and this water bottle. So these words are used for pointing out towards certain things. And that is why they are called as demonstrative adjectives. Let us see the next type. Interrogative adjectives. Interrogative adjectives are those words which ask questions and that is why they are called interrogative adjectives. For example, what, which, whose. What book, which table, whose pen. These adjectives are used with nouns for asking questions and that is why they are called interrogative adjectives. Let us see the next type. Possessive adjectives. Possessive adjectives are those adjectives which are used for showing possession of the nouns with which they are used. For example, my, his, her, your, its. How they are used. My book, his pen, her table, your pen, its leaves. All these words are showing possession of the nouns with which they are used. Let us now see the next type. Distributive adjectives. Distributive adjectives are normally used with singular nouns. And why they are used? They are used for referring to members of a group, but individually. They are used for referring to the members of a group, but individually. For example, either Neither, each, every. Either child, neither child, each child, every child. So here they are speaking of members of a group, but then they are speaking of them as individually. Now let us see the next time. Proper adjectives. Proper adjectives have been derived from proper nouns. And they can be used for certain persons, specific persons, places, or maybe some particular animal or thing. For, ex 
example Indian, French, Japanese and British. Let us see how they are used. Indian goods, French perfumes, Japanese cars and British goods. So they can be used for certain persons, maybe some specific languages, specific places or maybe some specific things. And hence they are called proper adjectives. Let us have a quick recap of all the kinds of adjectives. First, adjectives of quality. Second, adjectives of quantity. Third, adjectives of number. Fourth, demonstrative adjectives. Fifth, interrogative adjectives. Sixth, possessive adjectives. Seventh, distributive adjectives. And the final one is proper adjectives. I hope you have understood the kinds of adjectives. Do like and subscribe my video for the updates.